Blessings and blessings, beautiful people of the planet Earth. Oh, oh! My name is Preston Smiles and I help people get free from the inside out. And today's transmission is how to stop feeling overwhelmed instantly. And my process, my methodology on how I do that while having four kids under four, three seven-figure businesses, and a huge life that I'm leading all at the same time. Now, I'm going to start by saying that. My friends often ask me and tell me when I'm leading my calls uh, for Amplify or different programs that I lead, people often ask me, how are you doing what you're doing without burning out? And it's not that I don't get tired. It's not that I don't even experience overwhelm, it's just that I have a methodology to get out of it quicker than most people do. So you're gonna to wanna to stick around for this entire thing and if you are new to this family, to the Love's Voice family, to the Preston Smiles family, please make sure you click that red subscribe button and click the thumbs up and leave a comment below so that the algorithm shows this to more people, right? That's the name of the game for us to get this message out. And this is not my message, this is our message. Use, hold please, hold for allergies. There we go. Use this space, use the tools that I put in this space, elevate your life, get free from the inside out, and give the gift, keep giving the gift. That's the name of the game for all of us. Get to the top of the mountain, whatever the mountain is for you. Enjoy the mountain, but put your hand back down and bring some people up. So let's go into this. Overwhelm, what is overwhelm? It is more than likely uh, a moment or two <laughs> or an hour or two of you experiencing yourself not being able to handle what is currently on your plate. More than likely, and I'm gonna get to the philosophy first and then I'll get to the actual three-step process that I have. Um, but more than likely, you are doing things that are causing the overwhelm, AKA uh, you are ingesting maybe food that doesn't serve you. So that's one way, one thing to look at. What am I eating often when I experience overwhelm? And does the overwhelm lead to anxiety or is it, does it stop there? Right? These are questions to ask ourselves. What are you ingesting from a media perspective? Are you watching and listening to things that uh, cause slash give you the opportunity to be in fear? Because if so, that may be a part of what is occurring. Who are you hanging around and what is their ethos and disposition is are you hanging around your mom and your mom super stressed out all the time and experiencing overwhelm because if so you're going to be like her right is the, the the name of the game one of the names of the game because i keep saying that is to pull back far enough and bring awareness and ask yourself is this mine or is this programming is this conditioning if you're really looking you'll know for a fact that it's programming and conditioning. It is your brain uh, mentally rehearsing worst case scenarios, <clears throat> which is sending signals to your body, which is having you feel overwhelmed. So how do we beat it? It's a simple methodology. Stop, drop, roll. I'll say it again. Stop, drop, roll. Stop. The moment you start to experience overwhelm, stop. Literally stop everything. Deep breath in. <sighs> Release on a sigh. Do it three times. <sighs> Bigger each time if you can. With the whole body. <sighs> Step number one. Stop. Stop and breathe. Stop and move the body. Move. Shift your perspective, literally, physically shift your perspective. That's one. Number two, drop. Drop, meaning look at slash identify what it is that you're holding on to in particular 
that is causing you the most stress. Because often there is a particular thought that we're attached to unconsciously. I'm not even saying you're doing this on purpose. There is a thought that you're attached to. And when you bring awareness to that thought, and then ask yourself, is this serving me? One, two, do I want this? Even if it's true, do I, do I want to keep believing it? Out of all the thoughts in the world that I could be believing, do I want to believe this one that makes me feel crappy? Usually, that's enough space for you to recognize that it is not you and that you've been choosing in to something that's been unconscious and now we're bringing it to the consciousness. We're making it, we're bringing awareness to it, we're shining a flashlight on it, therefore it cannot control or, or manipulate you anymore. Boom. Next, inside of drop is, you are to write down everything that is occurring in your life. You need to dump, you need to get it out. One of the things I do often is an idea comes or something comes up, oh, I need to email that person, oh, I need to call that person, oh, I need to uh, wash the dishes, oh, I need to do this, oh, I gotta pick up my kid at four, oh, I gotta do, when all of that starts to occur, I just write it down. I write it down so I don't have to hold it. I write it down so I clear and cleanse and, and uh, give my, my, my mind as much space as possible. So you write it all down and then at some point, you identify the top three. What are the top three things in this list that I can begin to work and chip at? And what can go away from this list? What can I delegate? What can I give to somebody else? What can I just throw away? Delegate, throw away. Which leads us to roll. Roll is roll right into action. The moment you have the top three, go right into action and ask yourself what needs to happen, what needs to be set up, what needs to be put in place so that I can let this go and clear and cleanse my palate so I can be a beneficial present to the planet. Oh, so good. Blessings and blessings, beautiful humans. Uh, if you are needing support, make sure you go to PrestonSmiles.com forward slash amplify. Um, or just PrestonSmiles.com, you'll find some of my programs there. I have one called Amplify where I help people uh, raise their vibration. I'm doing it with my wife who's absolutely amazing and it's a do-it-yourself program. It's super cheap. It was uh, a couple thousand dollars and now I've made it almost free. So you want to go there and you want to get it now because I literally, yes, you're going to pay, but almost nothing um, for what it is. So um, make sure you move fast and also do these steps. Leave a comment below, please, 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 real quick, leave a comment below with anything that landed for you. Which step do you know you haven't been doing? And what are you going to, how are you going to implement th th this into your life? Blessings and blessings. I love you all so much. Peace, peace, peace.